When drawing the graph, always give your graph a title to show the physical quantities assigned to the x-axis and y-axis. Define the variables and label the axes where manipulated variables are labeled on the x-axis. Responding variables are labeled on the y-axis. Next, define the range of values of the variables and choose a suitable scale for the axes. Lastly, plot the coordinates and draw the graph. Remember to draw a straight line or smooth curve of best fit where applicable. Make sure the line must be passed through most of the plotted points and give equal emphasis to all the points which are evenly spaced out around the line. Analyzing the graphs In this graph, y is directly proportional to x. The equation is y equal to kx, where k is the gradient or slope of the graph. This graph shows that y is proportional to x plus a constant. The equation is y equal to kx plus c, where k is the gradient or slope of the graph, and c is y-intercept. This graph shows that y is proportional to negative x plus a constant. The equation is y equal to kx plus c, where k is negative, k is the gradient or slope of the graph, and c is y-intercept. In this graph, y is constant, that is y is not dependent on the value of x. The equation is y equal to c, the gradient of the graph is zero. This graph shows that y increases at an increasing rate. The possible equation as follow. This graph shows that y increases at a decreasing rate. The possible equation shown as follow. The graph shows that y decreases at a decreasing rate. The possible equation shown as follow. This graph shows that y decreases at an increasing rate. A straight line graph can be extended or extrapolated beyond the data collected as shown in the figure. The value of y when x equal to 0 is c and the value of x when y equal to 0 is d. Thank you for taking time to watch this.